Utatoka. 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 One, two. Utatoka. Acha na mchezo. Hello guys, welcome back. This is All Kinds Entertainment, another episode with me here at Chisa Mambal and today we are going to have another blast because with me here I have another comedian who I don't know if he actually knows he's is more of a comedian than what he really does in real real in actual life as a career. So we are going to dive deep here and you're going to keep up with so the other day I did another video that I gave it a title Steve Simple Boy, the God of Comedy. Now, leave alone the God of Comedy. We now have the president himself. Not sorry. The president of Comedy Kenya. If you did not know this guy is more of a comedian than an actual pastor. You're going to discover it today and remember to click the subscribe button like and let's get into it today you're not talking much because let me just show you i'll just let's just get into video don't let's not talk too much because it's a blast and remember to hydrate with me i have some drink here i won't say what it is but just not have some drink here because it's all fun we're going to laugh and laugh and laugh and laugh like the other time so make sure you click the subscribe button and let's get into it let's uncover so guys before we start with the video i'm gonna say this no offense to those people who go to church of neno i don't know the church exactly but we, we, as we move on the video we will discover it so no offense to people who go to the church that this pastor preach in this is just a reaction video which is meant for entertainment because this channel is all kinds of entertainment and this guy is more funnier than even other things that he does like he does it best when it comes to comedy without even knowing he's more of a comedian so this is why i'm doing this video and no offense i'm gonna repeat that because some of you are gonna paint me they paint me out to be the bad girl but i'm not gonna do this I'm not doing this for like for negativity negative intentions or no i'm not doing this for entertainment purpose we do all kinds of entertainment and if you get that you get it so here let's just get into it now yes so here we have this guy you can see him this is the person we are talking about and even google this knows who he exists so with the, according to google pastor nganga biography Apostle James Maina Nyanga, that is his real name, and his church is called Neno Evangelism. Neno Evangelism, that is his church. He's one of the richest, all that kind of things about Google that says about him. So, Nyanga is known to be that guy who talks, he, who lets his intrusive thoughts win. You know, these people who are more of comedians and they don't know. There are these people who talk without even knowing, like these things they're saying, it's funny. Like we saw the other day in the video we did last time. It's exact, the exact same thing is happening here. It's happening here, but this kind of comedy is different from that. This is another level of comedy. That's why this, this guy is more of a president of comedy than a god of comedy. You know what I'm saying? If you get it, you get it. So, Nanga is known for making these crucial and very stand out, that stand out headlines. Headlines that when you read them, you're like, is this guy really a pastor? Is this guy really a pastor? So, yeah. Let me go with the first one you have here. Pastor Nanga responding, responding to Snoop Dogg. Pastor Nanga responding to Snoop Dogg. Another one we have here. Pastor Nanga elites mixed reactions after charging his congregants 100 cash for a bottle of 1,000, 1,000 cash for a bottle of water. Imagine. Like this guy does what he thinks and he doesn't give a crap. 
Here another headline. Situende binguni tuone kama kuna English. Mambo ya English enda utafute kazi. Okay. I told you like let his intrusive thoughts win. Pastangana trending again with this video. I don't know what kind of this video was that, but I just found this headline. We have another one here. Pastangana King Kaka wewe ni mjinga. Mama yako ni my girlfriend. This was when King Kaka shot his most trending songs of all times that was called Wajinga Nyinyi. So, Nganga, who is Nganga not to respond? You all know, Nganga will respond. Nganga has a say in everything. He lets his intrusive thoughts win. He says what he thinks. He doesn't hide. He doesn't, he's not scared of the politics, whatever. He talks anything. Like that level of confidence is what I want. Now we go we get into the first video. I'm not going to give you a biography or an outline about Nyanga's life and all that. No, we're just going to straight because this video is a reaction of his comics clip. So we're not going to dive deep into his lifestyle or whatever. We're just going to go into the comics that he comic comic comics clips. Hope you're getting it. So Pastanganga responding to Snoop Dogg. Let's listen to what he said. Like this man cracks me out. Imagine this guy called Snoop Dog Sniff Dog. Imagine that, bruh. And he says that. I'm gonna replay this back. Sniff dog, simuni food dog, simuni food dog, simuni food dog. Mimutu moja kama Michael Jackson. Nasikia alika. He doesn't even know what he does. He just know he's somebody like Michael Jackson. Like he doesn't even know Michael Jackson in the world. So if you, are, you know about a musician and you don't know about his whatever, just compare it to Michael Jackson. You just have clarified that. Just compare him or her to Michael Jackson. Mutu kama Michael Jackson. All right, good. Aliweka hiyo akapata comment more than 1 million akatoa. Wewe si nipu dog. Snoop dog. Wakaba wanasemaga ukaa manya. Second Peter. And it goes on with the is the word. It doesn't even like care like he said. If I could be in this church. Oh my god, they would chase me out because I can't stand it like you are making fun. You are doing comedy without even knowing, and I sit there like, bruh, I'm gonna crack out until they chase me out of that church. I'm not even lying. Another video here, which is the most trend, this is one of the most outstanding video that Nyang has ever done because of TikTok. You are not TikTok. People are going to lip sync, people are going to redo, people are going to react, and this, let's just take it, check it out. Drinking water. Si pobe ni maji. Nani ya likuwa mimi? Mamba ni maji. Shut up. Tusema ni kuna kitu na kunyoga na weka hapa na nafisha. Wacha ni weke hapa. Hata ni kunyo na yako. Mini lika yako. Ni maji. Nani ya mwudizu. And how does age relate to drinking? Maji hii. Ok. Sabu siku hisi mkuna vituko nyingi. Siji muna toa vituko. Tafuta lika yako mcheza nao. Mi nita hivyo 72. Mi ata staki mutu anichagwe, musiri chagwe Mi ata kuchagwe Asa kuchagwe From Bombay to Edge Kuchaguliwa nao Sita si mama Nandi si mama sita ataka yako Ia, look at people lip syncing it This is a guy just A tiktoker And he's drinking alcohol That is glibay Shut up Another one. People are like loving this, like, bro. See, poor Ben Emaji. Just see. Take a look at look at all this. Look at all these people have just lip sync to my to Pastanganga's audio, and he was just doing it. He wasn't doing it like for intention of like like creating a trending sound. He was just doing it like for fun. Not even for fun, like he was just doing it like in real business, real talk. Because people would take it 
whatever. And we all know you're drinking water, but he has to prove. So let's just take a look at how you all commented here. Because it's never fun until you go to the comment section here. I wonder, bro, he just starts fighting from lawyer. He'll be fighting in this. <laughs> Attending Pastor Ganga service is in my bucket list. Ah, uh, me too. But I will be chased out of that chat because that is so funny. So how does that even relate? I was saying that was how. Well, okay. I'm not gonna wanna Kenya Mzima this is not to talk bro. Because he talks to people like kids. He doesn't even bother who is listening, who is the audience. Na nikisi mama kitataka ya wako. Mind though. Mind though. Yeah, that's that, that little thought. True definition of gaslight yourself then. Bryce, <laughs> we are pressuring himself. Like, gotta keep your pressure then start fighting from nowhere. Our commander is always against. <laughs> <laughs> like I said, it's never funny until you go to the comment section. Okay, yani, eh, but uh, I'm not gonna read all of this because you all are funny. We have another one here. Pov, I know another personal trainer who is cheaper than you. Then you, the trainer. Look at the trainer. Now here, this is the number. This guy is a pastor. And here, we are in church. Guys, we are in charge, not not like like it's not like a uh, a congregation of we are in church. Church. Are you getting what I'm saying? We are in church. So this is young. I don't know what kind of training. I, I I don't know. Let's just see. Bro, look at those men. People are dressed very casual, very like neat to go to your church just to do some workout. Bro. Yeah. Aya, up, two. bro. <laughs> <laughs> He's laughing at them. <laughs> Pastor Nganga. He's called Pastor Nganga, James Maina Nganga. If you don't know him, he goes by the... <laughs> Imagine we are still in church. He's in church. He does all these comics clips in church, and he doesn't even know. He doesn't do it for intention of being comedy, of like making a comedy. Like no, he does it for the church. Like he's, he's preaching. That is his way of preaching. If you don't get it, you just don't get it. You get out of that church. <laughs> <laughs> Just listen how he talks. <laughs> Just call that man a cow. I don't know if it's a man or a woman. Another like this guy. Somebody said in the I saw I saw something. Somebody said Anganga is always abusing his like his fellowships, like those his believers, those who come for in his church. This guy abuses them. You have seen he has called that one Fala. Yeah, now he's casting another shield. Bro, this guy doesn't respect the audience. Another like. I'm Kanani. I'm too ashamed. I love my Haji. Haji Changa and Kuzima Wakwanza. Bro, man, I'm still in church. This guy was sleeping. This woman just slept. Maybe it would be accidentally or something. But the pastor himself. It's like we're in school. He's passing around and finding you asleep. Bro is gonna slap you, wake you up, and chase you out of the church. Like I said, let's take a look at this. He's chasing the woman out of the church. Bro. 
again. Let's see this one. Actually, he does this kind of comics clips, like a thousand of them. So we're gonna watch like a bunch of them. What's up? Facebook yake is Zoom. Sasa wewe unajua kwa Zoom ni nini? Unajua? Yeah. Eh? Remember he's preaching. He's just not joking. He's preaching. does that even relate? What was he talking about? I, I would like to know the context behind this. Because from nowhere. And that is an old woman. That is not fair, Nang. That is not fair. This is an old woman. She's not like that young teenager or something. You are funny. You are the one who is funny, <laughs> not the lady. Because the question you are asking. Lace. Luto. Eh? Luto. Eh? Luto, Luto, Luto. Lace, okay. Now you got that. Na governor Nairobi. Governor Nairobi. Yeah, I have Sumbwa. The church is not for the weak. This pastor can really bring your self esteem down. Like I said, because the way he is telling that woman is not fair. Boss, I'm not happy. Please, I beg me to how can you ask an old woman like It's just like that is not fair at all. Guy at Kweli when Kweli father, that is someone's mother, okay, bro. That that was so that was that that, that he stooped so low. Was another acting like he's better. Let me see this. Acting like he's better than her, and he doesn't. He's even a is older, way older than that woman. Why can why call her father? I feel it. Me too, bro. Because she's just she doesn't even know what the fuck to get Zoom. That woman is old. How does she know Zoom? Whatever. He church nakuanga nakuwa backbench or like. So someone ame ame ongea kikamba shiwali. One day I will attend this church. <laughs> Me too. Machine for me. <laughs> Actually, y'all are saying here a lot. Let's just move on. I don't want to read all these kind of comments. Hilarious. Hilarious. Pastor Nanga cracks his congregants rib with the laughter. Let's see this. Ameka na mke wake wa meda wa kapimu wa kabi wa hana mayai. Sasa wezi juka mwukuna mayai. Mwukuna yo. What kind of eggs? <laughs> what kind of eggs are you talking about? Let's see this. Uwo ni nimepaka devura zangu ni rangigini. Let's see this. How does that relate? Let's see this. Let's see this. Let's see this. This is weird. Shut up. <laughs> Usiede hapo ukachukua mawe na Machawi ni wegi sana Jaribu kweda hapo ni shaa chukua mawe Uwezi kanyaga hapo uwezi Kikanyaga hapo utanyongo usiku mzima Bwa I get it In the name of Jesus In the name of Jesus Mulikuwa nae wapi Sasa ananiabia kuruka mwakati ni mulipia mtoto Eh Nika muliza Taidi namba yako ni gapi Kazema baba, mimi si baba Don't call me baba, baba ya nani Baba unajua Tago nitoke sijarudisha 80 years, then you want me to be my member You are not my member You are not my classmate My dear friend, nilikuwa chia Hapo ulipo ni achia Now he's so picky Now he's so picky with his followers Now he's rejecting that follower Because he's older Hata kabla uzika Takwabia mwemu, jinga wewe 
kufa unaniwachia 90 million sijaribu na jikuficha hapa si ungekuja tulipe 90 million amka tulipe kama <laughs> what my eye are you talking about me to am wondering you mean this this is this a real man of god all those people sit and listen to his gospel very interesting like bra I, i wonder why what those people gain because okay let me not kuna registration pia kuingia hii church nataka nikuje jehu never disappoint i got sit and listen to this bro me too bro because like i i will love the entire time i can't sit that entire time there listening to see what this guy say <sighs> somebody say that nimbe go see my eye like bro how can you just say like in a public place my eye like that you know what people think people think this are it's just about balls even me for first time listening to, I, i thought it was balls but it, it's not that it's just like it's manga wonders who who you ni christian ama ni ngombe ama ni punda ya babesha ni bro first nganga shocking remarks to one of the congregants ni christian let me reply this christian ama ni ngombe ni christian ama ni punda hii ya kubeba mizigo ya shetani how can you lie even in in the church kusema tu tukiruka mwaka sasa unasema last friday sasa wananiletea mtoto mgojo ni kama million ndiri sana wewe. Unaokota magojo huku unalete hapa. Bro, so amuoni bure. Madaktari wenyewe amuoni bure. Lakini kifika nyumba ya Mungu you just come assuming hapa ni kwako. Unalipa rent hapa. Unalipa stima hapa. Let us go back. Unalipa hii stima. Ukitoka jubani kule ulitoka unafikiria mugu ni nini ni mto Bona hauku muonea huko kwa sababu you are understanding ya mugu is so bad so loco I wonder how and why people attend hiyo kanisa Me too because wase because how can he talk like that like Okay, let me not judge. Wase ni chanweni please. Kai, these followers wa nganga wako sawa. Are they obsessed? This is more than serious. Nganga my dear, they can never make me hate you. <laughs> you should go with money. Like I love people who are funny. You are funny, we are bros. Hizi ko nilikuwa hiyo church. Let me tell you my fellow girls. Are you for real? <clears throat> I think it's too much bring your burden unto me says the Lord. I this is too much. God bless you man of God. Such teachings will heal this generation of the some people they don't understand the pain of the gospel. More grace. I understand that too. But people should not take God like God is cheap. Like Christians are supposed to be poor whatever no. I I think that that way he said it well but the words he used he doesn't he doesn't have a good choice of words that that is the the problem with nganga but he says things very correctly he's actually a true pastor if you don't believe in nganga just don't go to his church that is the point if you don't believe don't go to the church to cut the conversation short don't go to the church if you don't believe in him because Like that guy is funny. He can be funny, he can be rude, he can be all of that. It's not like others. It's not like others. It's not like other creatures. It's not like us. They're not like us. <clears throat> This will be the like, my last day in church. <laughs> If I could be just in that church, that would be my last day too. But I'll still maybe listen to the preaching the problem is the church members i thank god squad your church aliwaambia yake ni kioski mkakata kumsikia if you are a man of god and we have preached for like like for instance for nganga he has preached since 2000 plus 2007 so he has those rooted followers that will never change their belief those pastors who started preaching long ago like for instance we have prophets like prophet award like he started preaching back then so you have those people who have rooted for him since the beginning it's just like a musician you are a fan you can never like change because 
he has he has like done something wrong you know what i'm saying like maybe a musician has shot like a uh, not really good hit of song like just like weird song you cannot say it's not it's no longer my favorite he's not, i'm not gonna listen to his music again that is how it works if you have base, he has grew his fans so it's just like funny just like fun base and preaching like i don't know if you are relating to that and also remember Nganga is an apostle he's not like a prophet he's not like an evangelist or what he's just a, an apostle of god so sometimes he can be on his like he, can, he, can, he has his faults and he has his he has his ups and he has his downs so if you take it negatively i don't know what's your problem because that is who he is that's why he has his followers. If you are confused, like, how do people go to, to that church? There are some people who have learned a lot from this man. And there are some who have not liked you there. So, don't complain. I'm very sorry. Pastor, Pastor Nganga is not sorry. Pastor Nganga is not sorry. Let me see that. Pastor Nganga is Pastor not Nganga sorry. Internet. How can I say sorry? I'm not the one who caused the problem. It's internet. I'm not sorry. <laughs> What is going on? How did that start? Like, this, this guy is always fighting. Like, he's always quarreling for no good reason. Like, from now, it's just that. But Kanana is not sorry. Okay. What happened? I'm very sorry. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the way he changes. I'm very. I'm not the one who caused the problem. It's internet. Yeah. I'm not sorry. Okay, you're not sorry. I'm not sorry. Okay. It is not me. Who was, how can I say so? <laughs> this guy always fights with his own invisible enemies. Like someone said, he immediately apologized to himself for this. <laughs> Kenyans are about to misuse this sound, like I said in TikTok, you know? Like Kenyans. <laughs> this should just join, this man should just join comedy because. Like I said, that took a very huge turn. Like he was so like looked apologetic. I'm very sorry. And then that some so, something reminded him, you are a nganga. <laughs> you know you are a nganga. <laughs> he switched. I'm I'm very sorry. I don't know sorry and you see me. Ah, Kenya is not a real <laughs> Teacher, where my children are going to school. Some teachers who have mental. My child, I don't know what issue. my child did. Not mental. Then I went there. I was caught. Now another green, I don't know what the child did. My wife went there. Okay. School. Then this teacher said that unless his father come, I said, I will not come. My own best. I'm paying you money. Oh, yes, that, that, is, that is his wife. She's so gorgeous. Well, lastly, I can go to school to listen nonsense. I am paying you to educate them. They're stupid. Don't call me. If you want to call. Sasa mimi ni edhe nekaya hapo kwa mwalimu ni aniabie nini. Ibu wei imagini. Hei. Hello. Mwari mwenye wa tapikiri ya nini sasa. And this year ni stupid. Mimi ni kaya bonganga. Mwari mwenye wa mabu ya watoto. Mimi mwenye wa naona ukiwa mutoto. He knows his nganga. Like I said. He keeps reminding himself. You are a nganga. Mimi ni kaya bonganga. Nganga. Never. Naona ukiwa na pepo. Okay, let's just keep keep it going. I'm not going to No, how are you? At our age, you say, "Mutu hapa ni munene, hapa ni kaki tu kasi, tu mego ni tu dogo." Kwani imwiri na loga na lona hapa tu? Eh, tana kaki pita. Eh, at our age, na uliza ga kwedi ni imwiri ya ukwedi. Daudi ya kagalia mwanamuke Tunaogea mabo ya wale watu wanaribu Daudi ya kagalia Mwanamuke 
Tunaogea nani? Man after my heart ni Daudi. Akaona mwanamke hapo. Wachawi hawa. Umetaka kule kuota uje kuogea kwa kwa dirisha ya ya mvarim. Weka hotel Murogi. Si ukiogea huko juu. Umekaruka kuogea na wamelika dirisha ya mvarim. Daudi alipona akasema wewe komanda hebu lete hiyo. Like I said, nyanya is just nyanya. He will use comedy doesn't even know he, it's comedy and pass his message you can see now he's relating to the bible the story of david but it's funny to listen to it like you just see his that one is called nganga nobody like him have you heard of another nganga you have one hata sa hizi wanawake wanaua mabwana zao i can speak that wanawaua sababu akitebea aki attract wanaume kuna wanaume wako na majini yani spirit yao ziko juu naogea mimi ndisi yangu ni deliverance the more anaendelea ku attract okay that story was so long so it, it was just cut there is si aongelesha ambarei okay so can i talking about ambarei <laughs> yeah. like okay ambarei my search ba ambarei Ambare is that your comma is that you? Nah. Okay. Let's move on. So you was man, talking man. to Ambare in dialect. No Nanga doesn't even know. I don't think Nanga even knew. It was reflecting to somebody. Nanga just saying what let his intrusive thought wins. That's why no the fans would just like to picture it with somebody but I don't think he was specifically talking about mm -mm. I don't think a prayer for all single ladies and men in Kenya. In Kenya kwa hii church, tarusha tu nje. Akatumbi tu. Akai sab nothing, bro. Wanaume amejaoa simama. Kuna mtu kwa nyumba. Okay. Hawi. Kwani ni kanisa ya masigo hii? Hai. Umesikia kwa hivi nimesema? Mimi kama sigo. Ndio kuja wote. Soga soga huko. Nilikuwa nafikiri sisi kama mnaona ni vizuri. Nilikuwa nafikiri tuite wale wamama wale hawajaolewa wasimame hapa waonane. Patanisho in charge. No. Only Nganga can do that. Aya wale hawajaolewa simama. It's only Nganga in Kenya. Kenya is not a real place. Imagine a pastor like okay. Nari Nganga. Jo hapa tu usikaribia huko kae hapa tu kuja. Kuja tu. Kuja. Jo usimame hapa. And they are going. Kuna roho mpya inakuja. Yes, kuja. Yeah. Yes, kuja. Simama hapa, angalia huko. Hapa. Simama kwa hii red. Yeah, angalia huko. Kuna nyota ilipotea yako, leo nyota inarudi. Nyota, nyota iko hapa. Eh, hey, hey, hey. gaiwa kwa hii na red. Gaiwa kwa ni mimi. Hii meenda. Soka soka huko. Eh. <laughs> And it's, it's yeah, having a blast. Ja yeah, imefunguka tunaondoka. <laughs> Shimu tupigie makofi nyinyi jamani. <laughs> These guys from Masa another planet. Agaria tu kama gani? Point. Wewe kusema. Amesema anaona mmoja hapa na hata sema. Na wewe unaona kuna tugoje. Unaonaje? Professor hapa professor huwezi kosa. Now listen. Nataka kanisa tufanye ibada kwa sababu ya watu hao. <laughs> This story goes all the way. Sasa we na Pastor Nanga needs to be stopped. This is too much now. Let's listen to this my lord. Umetairiwa. Bra, bra. Ati yule kijana alikuwa hapa. Kuja baadhi wewe. Ati Mwele kijana walikuja hapa Alikuwa mkorino Where's the camera? Where's the camera? Where's the camera? Ule alikuwa na D Ule alikuwa na ubiri kekomba Mkorino? Eee Ule alikuwa na katarama We umeo uko na muke? Eee Na hacha hivyo na ubiri Mungeza katoto kengine Ate wacha hivyo na ugea Umeogesa? Number four Uh, he, he looks young for real. Look at that. He looks young. Four. 
Don't blame it. Look at that guy. He looks young. Don't blame it on Nganga. Baby. Ukunywa pombe. Okay. We ukule ukule pombe mtura na vichwa za ngombe na kuche kusumbwa. Akuchangishi. Okay. Ukule nyama. Ukule mutura. Ukule vichwa vya ngombe. Mwakotaji wewe. Ukule ungangano. Ukule mandazi. Ukule mchele. Mulafi wewe. Okay. Ukule ungangano mwakotaji. Kwa hivyo. Kidi ni imekata kufanya kazi Utushagicha hapa tukupatia kidi Sikuwa siku kupatia kidi ni yako Mwame kula yako Usiliti Wise words from Apostle Nganga Married woman Let's listen to his wise words Actually we have been listening to him talking up Making fun and comics Let's listen to at least his wise words And see if he can be wiser than we think Umesikia Unajua kuna wabini mmekuja, mkuna akili ya utoto Ati muna uwa mpango wakando Sasa mpango wakando na mpango wandani Nani mkubwa? Mpango wandani Sasa mpango wandani, auchugi nyuba yako Kasi yako ni kushita tu ukitanga tanga Nyuba ni yako, mume ni wako Mungu wamekuleta kwa hii nyuba kufanya nini? Musaidisi Sini musaidisi? Ha? Chone kuwanesha Kutoka leo Kutoka leo Nisa kwa hiyo jinga mimi Nidi ya kuhulimu wa ngoma Wakati buwana yako hayuko Weka koti yako hapo yake Na sikuka buwana yangu Na kusukuka Na kujangia ukuta 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 Tulia mzee Tulia Mwa 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 Only nganga can do this Babe Leo naonaji mzee Leo Mechoka Siki kwa bemoja tukunyo ya chai Sweetheart, I love you I love you baby Saigine chukua hiyo koti yake Va Va Tase maji Dio hiyo nikonai, jaribu kumuguza Jaribu kumuguza ye Jaribu kumuguza ye sasa Jaribu, jaribu, jaribu Jaribu kumuguza ye, jaribu Mwe werefu kama ngombe ama kama nyoka kama nyoka kisho mwabie hii koti ujavaa siku nyingi hata hii nimepewa na mama nivaye sijui kama labda aki dia meniwekea hii guy jesus dia meniwekea hizi mimi nimeona zimehangiwa hapo tu nikabiwa baa hizi sijui kama aki dia wa miss ok nana is so close with his like his how do we call his followers that he can tell them this way let's let's take a look at this take a look at this hey you must be my hero aha that's the best year the cars are like you you need to be able to do what what's up what would do now we're going to get it i you can tell he's so close with his followers. That's why they go to the, his church. I saw some of you were asking, how does these people still go to that church? They go for a reason. They are so close. They are so connected to his to his preaching and how he preached. And that's why Nganga and every other kinds of pastor of this kind, they have followers. So guys, I hope you had a blast. It was so fun watching Pastor Nganga, if you have if you are requesting for another part because this one was so short was it long it was kind of short so if you want another part two of Pastor Nganga, i'll be dropping it click the comment section if it goes more than 10 i will bring another video so thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys in the next one remember to click the subscribe button like and share bye